outside the Fertile Crescent. Too long out of her seashell, too far away from green waves sparkling as they lick the sky, Aphrodite falters. Shallow ponds delay her sea surge. Off course, inland, tired, dry. She takes a man's word ser seriously when he offers water. He owns a well. She settles in his oasis. His one tree, his human heart, cast their spell. For such implosion, she serves him gratefully. He keeps her safe from her, his city of those who are wicked. She gets water enough, cupfuls, pitcherfuls, to cook and wash clothes, not to plunge in. Pillared when she calls his bruff at dawn, her salt crystals gleam, flushed with rose.